Hi everyone, it's Carly Reese and welcome back to my channel. Today is weirdly my first day of college and it's 12.30 in the afternoon. Um, I kind of planned to wake up at 10, but some things changed last night and I just didn't get enough sleep. I mean, who gets enough sleep literally on the first night of school? And why would I wake up if I don't have to at a certain time, you know? But now I'm up, here I am in my egg chair. I'm logged into my little online platform. And I see just like a bunch of stuff for like each class. So I really don't know like what I'm going to be doing today. I would assume that like the first week is literally going to be the most simple stuff ever. I just feel like it's going to be a lot of reading like syllabuses and stuff like that, like class instructions. I really don't think it's going to be like actual work at this point. I have been getting emails from my teachers for about like the past two like nights or so, more so last night because you know it's like literally the night before and they just wanted to have everything posted for like the day of. My cat is on top of the egg chair right now. But basically all my teachers have told me like you do not have to log in to class like at a specific time. Like it's completely like work at your own pace kind of thing. Like do the work when you're gonna do the work. But make sure like you're logging in at least like three times a week. Before I get into like trying to figure out what the school stuff means, I got this planner. It's very cute. Um, it's purple, which is typically not my like go-to. But I really liked the inside because the other planner that I had just got kind of like, I don't know, just didn't fit my needs, you know? What I mean by that is it didn't have a layout like this where like I could actually write stuff down like that I have to do each day. As you can see, today is August 29th and I have listed that it is my first day of school. I like this layout in particular simply just because like I can literally list like assignments and stuff like throughout this. And there's even like a huge long to-do list right here. And that just makes me like feel like a lot better like I don't know I just feel like I could write so much more stuff down in this planner and I actually like kind of want to use it and then I just have like little sticky notes these are mostly for like my reading books not like my school books like literally books that I read on my own like sometimes I like to like you know tab things I do have all my school books over there which I don't even know if I'm gonna need those but I also got a bunch of these super cute highlighters and pens my cat won't leave me alone. As I'm kind of like looking around on my screen, I just want to explain to you guys, I do go to UT, which is the University of Toledo. My major is criminal justice. In a second, I will tell you all of my classes for the semester, but I am 100% online. And the reasoning for that is just because I work better in my own spaces by myself independently. I literally have done online school for the past two years now. I did not completely go to high school the entire four years. I, my junior year and senior year, did 100% online and I loved it. So that's why I'm doing online college. I'm kind of just giving you like a little background on like my schooling right now. So I really did not plan to go to college until about literally in the middle of the summer one day I was like, I'm gonna go to college because I don't know what else I'm gonna do. And I don't really know if YouTube is my forever life. So it would just be nice to have like, you know, a backup plan on something that like I really actually wanted to do for the rest of my life. So that is the moral of the story. Now to explain to you my classes. What in the world? To explain you my classes, I have Microsoft Office Applications, which is like a computer thing. And then I have a criminal justice class, I have a policing class, I have a college composition class, which is English. I have a health and human services orientation, which is literally every freshman is required to take like an orientation class. And then my last class is introduction to sociology. For the most part, they all sound like electives and like super fun, so I'm really not like, too mad about my classes. I actually love them. The only one I'm just like not excited about is English. I'm just never, I just have never been like an English girl or anything like that. So I'm just not too excited. But we're just gonna click on whatever's on top. I literally am like clicking on stuff and like I don't know. I'm just so confused like what I'm supposed to click. So it looks like for my first class, there's a welcome letter, a course syllabus, and a course calendar. I don't know. Hopefully, this is all I have to do for the day. Like, I'm gonna be so confused. Like, like, how am I supposed to know if, like, things are submitted or not? Like, I don't know. I'm so confused. But I'm gonna go through and read these and I'll come back. So, y'all, um, it's now the second day of school. I kind of, like, left on such a random note yesterday. I, like, couldn't figure something out in, like, a class. I can't even 
I can't even remember exactly like the last thing I filmed but I was trying to like work on my first class and then I wanted to go downstairs and like print the syllabus so I literally was just like bye and I did not film anymore so a little update from yesterday I was talking about my Microsoft Office applications class and I swear I literally spent like two hours on it for there to literally be no assignment due even this week. For some reason I thought it was like such a main priority to like take my time, print the syllabus, highlight things. Like what was going through my mind when I thought that was like the most important thing of that entire class. I mean like I know I should read it but I have five other syllabuses to read and I just spent so much time like thinking I was going to be so like particular in every single class and... That didn't get me very far because I didn't even get to touch any of my other classes. So looking at looking at my main page here, I have only literally opened the first two classes yesterday. I worked on the computer class and I worked on criminal justice. So basically I guess I'll just share like the assignments that I did in my criminal justice class the only thing that was due was literally a discussion post introducing myself and again for some reason that took me like an hour and a half because i'm such a perfectionist and like i just like really needed to like make the perfect paragraph to introduce myself for some reason so that's pretty much what i did yesterday and i did look at my policing class but i really didn't get that far but i wanted to share something with you guys because like my planner that I talked so highly on yesterday literally threw it in the garbage. I didn't actually throw it in the garbage, but I just don't think I'm gonna be using it anymore because I don't know, planners are just so much work. And I've literally, I feel like I bought so many planners in my life and I can't keep up on it. But Asha introduced me to this thing and I feel like part of the reason why I did not get most of my work done yesterday is because I was spending more time working on this little online platform thing that I'm going to share with you in a second. This is not a brand deal, but it should be because I actually love this so much. But yeah, basically I spent like literally hours last night before I went to bed like working on this one. I should have actually been doing school, but let me show you. So here we go. This is a website called Notion. Asha actually introduced this to me and it has become my lifesaver. So basically what you do is you can make like different like subjects and stuff. You have to like go online and like download like a um, template basically and then go through and like literally you have to figure out how this website works. You kind of have to like tamper with it in your own way because it's not only used for like school and stuff like this. So you just kind of have to tamper it like how you want it. But okay, so this is what I'm talking about is this. You can literally put every assignment you have due and for college this is like super helpful because most teachers kind of go through and like release like oh these are like all your assignments that are going to be due for the rest of the year i know there's some teachers like i went through my english class and she only releases assignments like weekly but this is every assignment i have to do for this class over here is just a combination of literally all of my classes like together so that's really nice and then there's also like a calendar view of it so i absolutely love this and you can even make it cute like look i added like this cute little photo and stuff like that it's so adorable so if anyone sucks at using planners literally like me um freaking throw the thing away and get this website because you also can have access to it on your phone and it's so much better than just like having like literally like a notepad like in your phone and like typing it all out with bullet points like this is so much easier to keep track of because you can like view like all of the assignments together or assignments by subject or assignments by date like it's just so helpful like if you're in college and you really like want to keep track of things listen to me when i tell you that this website is amazing i hate english with like literally a burning passion i'm so bad at it and it's literally just the worst subject in the world i have gotten a lot done since the last time I talked to you, it is actually nighttime right now, Wednesday night, which would literally be like the third day of school. I'm looking at my Notion checklist right now, and it there's just like a lot more things checked off. I feel like I only have like a few more assignments to do for like this week to be like completely complete, which is really nice, but I'm kind of just starting to pay attention to English. I purposely like wanted to look at this class last because... I've just never been a fan of English. I just decided to look at it and there's three assignments due this week. I'm going to start working on this English assignment and I'll let you guys know how it goes. 
<laughs> I look like I haven't moved. That's what I finished my letter and I'm kind of going to show you. I don't want you to read it. I mean, it literally has my address on it. So like you can't see that. But basically you can just see it's like an entire paper and more. Tomorrow I'm kind of going to just try to like get the last couple of things done that I have like for this week. Because I have worked on every single class. Except for I have the last two English assignments I'm working on right now. And then I have whatever's due in sociology. So like if I get those done tomorrow... Or honestly, Friday, like, I have so much free time. Um, and we don't have school next Monday, so, like, that's really nice. So, if I end up doing schoolwork tomorrow, you will hear from me. But other than that, I do not know the next time you will hear from me. But I just need to go to bed because, like, I just feel like I've been doing school, like, literally 24-7. And, like, my mind is literally going to break in half. So, hey, guys. It has honestly been a while since I have filmed. It's actually Monday, September 5th, which is Labor Day, meaning I did not have school today. And I kind of just wanted to give you, like, a first week update. I know there were, like, points in time here and there where throughout, like, the first week of school I filmed. But it was just, like, kind of difficult for me simply just because it was like I was trying to focus on work like doing the homework and like figuring things out that like I really just didn't have anything to explain to the camera especially on the first day it was literally like I was sitting at my computer literally looking at everything like thinking I was gonna be like so ready to do this and just be like okay so like I'm already like done with this done with that the first day of school I literally worked on like work for like 10 hours maybe and I didn't even get to look at all my classes on the first day I only got to complete three of them the next day I worked on two of them and then the following day I finally worked on the last one I have had like some complications in some classes I had had a complication in my sociology class and I like emailed my teacher about it like I could not get an assignment that was due Friday at 11 59 to open I still can't I contacted her she didn't really give me much of an answer and then sent out like an additional email that like students need to like pay attention to directions and read the syllabus and like I did that but the link is still not opening so I don't really know what to do about that so I'm kind of just like in like such a stressful state right now I have not done any homework in like the past two three days or something like that because I ended up getting ahead and I have all my work done until Thursday which is great, which means basically tomorrow and the next day I don't have to do any work. Other than that, I feel like everything went pretty well. The one thing that I'm kind of struggling with is just like, I guess keeping up. And I don't mean keeping up like with due dates and stuff. It's just like, it seems like there's a lot of information in a lot of different places for every single class. And every single class is set up completely differently. Every single class has different due dates every week. It's just like, a lot to do six classes at once and a lot of my friends are either taking like four or five so the fact that I'm taking six I mean it's typically like normal for like a freshman I guess I mean I don't really know but I'm taking more classes than like my friends are and stuff so and they're pretty stressed out too so I mean I feel like I'm a lot more stressed out because like I have a whole nother class on top of that you know so thankful that like today I actually had like a day off because it did kind of start to feel like I was literally just doing school every single day and that was my only priority and I was like starting to literally lose my social life I wasn't going anywhere or doing anything outside of school and I hated that but like now that I kind of have things figured out I feel like things are gonna start going a little bit more smoothly and I say that with like so much hope um I also moved around my bedroom yesterday so like I literally just posted a room tour like last week I don't know what I'm gonna do about that I think I'm gonna do like a room tour <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna do a room tour but I'm gonna do like a little vlog hopefully for like next week and include my room in it and like a few other things that I have going on throughout the week because I have an exciting week this week. So yeah, overall this was my first week of college. It was overall, I would give it a 6 out of 10 because going into it I was a little too confident and that kind of like eased down a little bit because I just started running into like a lot of difficulties and stuff like that and still to this day I'm still confused about some things and I just like don't know exactly like what I'm going to do about that. Like I said I never got to do that freaking assignment that was due Friday at 11.59 and I emailed her and she gave me no answer so like I don't know what she expects me to do and I'm like so mad about that because like I don't know I just have like this perception in my head that college like professors do not care. They, I feel like they just don't care and they're not going to like you know be like oh you can figure it out you can have a whole extra week to do it now it's literally gonna be like you couldn't figure it out that sucks like 
it wasn't loading for you that sucks like that's how i just feel like it's gonna be but thank you guys so much for watching this video i really hope you guys enjoyed it i know it was a little bit all over the place and it just kept skipping from part to part to part i just tried to film like as much as possible of me like throughout the week you know like doing school whenever i had the chance so i hope you guys enjoyed it um thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye